y'all. Welcome to my car. And I'm going to call this day one of changing my prescription for semaglutide. Um, so I will say now the one I was on was um, Enhanced MD. And after I got on it, I discovered that the reviews for the pharmacy that they were getting my scripts from were awful. And a lot of, a lot of them are saying how the medicine was watered down. And you know, it's not FDA, whatever. So very possible, but I kept an open mind. I was like, maybe these people, you know, it's not working as fast as they want it to work or whatever. And so I gave them the benefit of the doubt. But after being on Manjaro, I get that this is different because it's, you know, the GLP one and not a two and Manjaro is two. But still, I kind of felt like it would be somewhat similar. What I really want is the the, the food chatter and the head to stop. And I could go a lot, a lot with that, go a long way with that. So I didn't. And pretty much all I would have is just acid reflux that first day and then was it and no help with you know anything like the fill fill in here whatever so I canceled that and then Noom came out with a with a GLP one excuse me my aunt had been on Noom I think at one time and I thought she had said she liked it now this is before the GLP ones that she was just on the program but I feel like maybe Noom is a kind of a more long term, long time standing kind of company. And maybe they're going to be a little bit more reliable and for giving proper compound formula of this. I don't know. I just want, I just want the help. I, I have been struggling with my weight most of my life and I'm tired of it and I hurt and I want to be able to walk and I want to be physical with my friends and go out and hike and I want to do things and not hurt so giving this one a shot yeah so I'm gonna give this one a try and this morning in a few minutes I need to get going I'm talking and not moving I need to talk and move um, I need to go get my blood work now What's different about Noom as opposed to the Enhanced MD one is I had to have the blood work before they would um, approve me or send my script. And it seems not it's not the case with, uh, with Noom. So, I mean, I already had a message from the doctor and said I was approved and that the blood work is just a... Um, kind of a formality um, just to make sure everything's okay but it, it doesn't have any stand on whether I get the prescription or not so I thought that was interesting I last time I made a mistake and had my my labs like at 3 30 and I also was working at uh, a job that and so I fasted for a really long time but I drank a lot of water which helped been able to get my blood drawn a lot better uh, this time, my appointment's 9.30. It's 9.23 right now. So, um, I need a hustle. That's not that far. But I haven't got as much water in me as I did the last time I did this. So hopefully it's not so bad. The guy that did it last time, if it's him, man, he did a good, good job. He didn't, I didn't even feel it. So, that's cool. I hope, I hope the same. Anywho, I'll try to drink some water. Um, yep. Um, go get my blood work done. And then the, I did notice like the Noom app has like different every day. I think you have like some courses you can do. Kind of help you along with like getting some physical activity, helping you with figuring out um, some healthy eating habits and such and so I'm gonna, I'm gonna do those and uh, it is a little interesting like <clears throat> the onboarding for enhanced MD super smooth 
same with Noom. I only had one hiccup, but it was my own fault. I accidentally mistyped my email address when I was setting up the Noom account, and then it charged me, but then wouldn't let me log in. I mean, but, so that took some little bit of figuring out. Um, but what I can tell about the uh, platform as far as uh, like counseling and that sort of stuff, it's just slightly different. Um, not, I don't know, I, I mean, I haven't really dived into it as much yet, but I will say it's not seeming at the, at the introduction here. It's not as user friendly as Enhanced MD's platform. Um, the on, like, you're, like, not in the app, like, an actual website, um, is very, like, broken out and easy to understand. You can schedule your virtual appointments with your doctor and a nutritionist, and it seems like with Noom, it's text messages mostly that you have your communications with. You don't really have the virtual thing so far. Anyway, that's what I think I can get from that. And then, um, like, your shipments and stuff is very clear on the website for Enhanced MD and Noom. Like, I haven't got my first shipment yet. Oh, so I can see on the app where it's saying it will be sent soon. As, so and then it says it will provide a tracking number so that's still to be determined on how that's going to go but uh, as far as like the injections I'll be going down I was up to 50 and my next one would be 60 units of the enhanced MD which I actually do still have I still have 3 weeks worth of my prescription from there so I might still do it my injection day is Wednesday, so I still might do it, but I don't, I don't know, because I just, I don't know if it's even doing anything anyway, but just so I don't maybe have a lapse in it, if there is something in there, I don't know, but, um, we, the case, um, so yeah, I don't know when that notes the next prescription from then from Noom is going to shift. So my dose is going to drop to I believe 20 or 25 units. Which for starting out is starting me out more than Enhanced MD did. Because Enhanced MD, MD started me out started me out at 10 units. So at least I'm not going all the way back. But it looks like they keep you on, like, Enhanced was doing me. So I did 10 units for two weeks, and then it went to 20. So every two weeks, it bumps. It bumped up 10 units. And so, um, it looks like they do more of a three, four week on the same dose before they move you. So based on results, I guess. So we'll see. How that goes. I know when I was on Manjaro, it did um, about a month. It was about every month that I would go up a dose, so it would be about the same as Manjaro with the new, as far as the, the dosage um, intervals. So, we'll see. Oh, I forgot I'm going to be by Goodwill. Maybe I'll go to Goodwill after we're done, since I'm right here. I never hardly ever go to Goodwill because it's not convenient. Pinpoint. Okay, I have arrived. So. Arrived on time, buddies. Alright, so I will see you all. Uno momento. Okay, we got our jab done. She was not... She was not very friendly. Uh, I tried to overcome her with some kindness, but uh, I don't know, man. Hopefully, she gets a, bit, have a better day. Something about somebody being all cantankerous that's about to stick a needle in you. It's a little off putting. I didn't mean to go this way. Taking a cruise, cruise around. Alright, right, it's a kid. Yeah, hopefully she has a better.
of her day. She at least did start humming some God Bless America while she was putting in my stuff. I was trying to make her know that I'm, I'm okay, I'm nice, you're nice. We're all nice people here. I think we left off where I was going to get my blood work and the girl was off her game and it turns out she was way off her game. Uh, she sent my lab results to the wrong doctor. So that's fun. That has nothing to do with the place I'm getting the compound formula or their program. It has everything to do with the local lab here and this girl's negligence, I guess. Today, my medicine arrived. So I will say enhanced MD, when it shipped, it shipped overnight and it, it did arrive as it should and cold and on ice and everything's good. This one also came from Florida. I hope not the same pharmacy as the other one because that was the questionable issue here. And it did not ship overnight. In fact, I think it took two days ish. In fact, it even says on here, second day air, but it, it definitely took a full day and some, but it came in this and the other one came in a FedEx ice thing. So let's open this up and see what we get in here and how, well, this one's branded with, with Noom and not the pharmacy. Interesting. So it is arriving like this now again this is not sponsored i'm paying for this on my own so i will be virtually uh, honest about everything wow um so the box is almost kind of like a <laughs> what apple comes in like she thick she got a fabric a fabric pole on it it's magnetic <laughs> Oh, shit, fancy. We've got these syringes, which I have a ton of from the last one too, so I'm good there. And some alcohol swabs. Looks like coming from the pharmacy hub. Please review this information, instructions, medication warnings. Instructions, inject 25 units on syringe subcutaneously once a week for four weeks. Then we have Noom is more than meds. Important information about your journey. It's like this. It's like a, just a little pamphlet. Just kind of walking you through, I think, some like you know, guiding to go through the app. What is semaglutide? It's a lot of like the same like online courses that were offered so far that I've taken most of this since I've been on a Manjaro and then the semaglutide. I kind of already know this bit of information, but it's still useful. It's good. Now, what um, <laughs> is nice that didn't come was and how to inject and where to inject and all these instructions. Okay, this is a nice because even Manjaro, my first time I got it, uh, it I messed up because I didn't know how to do it and the pharmacist didn't tell me how to do it. My doctor hadn't told me how to do it and I messed up my first syringe, um, which that is a self injecting one. I didn't have to like, I didn't have to do the this. 
manually. But so it looks like it's coming in this packet. This isn't cold. Comes in this little box. It's so tiny. So this is what it looks like. So it's a little baby one compared to the other one I had kind of um, concerning that it's not really cold and it's supposed to be cold so oh, about that hopefully it hasn't been warm for very long in here in the fancy box seriously this box is she fancy fancy all right I think we'll give uh, give her a go for my first injection. I don't know if you guys really want to see this, but if you do, we'll bloop, bloop it right down here. Thighs, navel, around the navel, or shoulders. Tell me something, tell me something. I haven't heard before Cause I'm restless And I'm dying to know more Show me something Show me something I haven't seen before Cause I'm tired Of the same boats the same I don't know why it looks like there's a bubble in there Okay My boobies are in the way Day one, what is today? Today is Thursday, the November 12th. First day of taking my noon injection. And starting weight is 200 and 98 pounds. So I have a little bit of a correction and I don't know why I've been, I, I did it all day because I had to put my weight in on the new app. And I put it in as 298. I weighed myself this morning. And in my head, that is what I saw. It's not. I get to take 10 pounds off of that, people. I mean, I weigh 10 pounds less than that. I don't know. I don't know why I decided I needed to weigh 10 pounds more. This maybe it makes me look like I lost 10 pounds in one day. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. But my starting weight for day one of Noom injection is 289. It is what it is. It is what it is. It's where I start. So we'll see how this goes. Bye, guys. Seasons coming. Oh.